Hi my lovely students how are you all i hope you all are doing well so today in this class we are going to continue our same lesson of maths from your mathematics textbook part 2 mental arithmetic open page number 21 so here it is the chapter number 3 mental arithmetic so in this lesson children we have started the exercise 3.1 and already we have completed i mean we have solved first second third main and fourth main right so if you are not seen those videos you will get the link in my description box just go and check it out okay so here in today's class we are going to start with the fifth main that is estimate the difference of the following by rounding off to nearest thousands place okay so here estimate the difference so whatever we have done in the previous class that is estimate the sum so here it is estimate the difference difference means we have to what we have to subtract right we have to minus whereas estimate the sum sum means we have to add okay so same thing here we have to do so following by rounding off to nearest thousand place to the thousand place okay so let's take the first example here you can see the first example we are having that is 65487 minus 46502 right so the same example i have written here so here it is the first we have to round off this number to the nearest thousand place you know what we have to do yes so if the digit at unit 10 100 is 1 2 3 4 5 then we have to replace unit 10 100 by 0 okay if the digit at 100 place if the digit at 100 place is 5 6 7 8 or 9 then we have to replace this unit 10 100 by 0 then we have to add to the thousand place here right so here now you tell me what is the Uh, i mean what is the rounded form of this number so here it is you can see unit 10 100 in the 100 place there is a 4 is there means what it is so first unit 10 100 and here 4 means we have to keep this 1000 and 10000 unchanged so it is 65 so let's put the comma so it is 65000 minus now come to the next number unit 10 100 so 100 in the 100 place we are having what we are having 5 means we have to replace unit 10 100 by 0 then we have to add plus 1 to the number which is there at 1000 place so it become 7 so it will become what 47 right so let's subtract this both so 65000 minus 47000 okay so let's do the subtraction so here it is there you can see Zero minus zero 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 minus zero 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 minus zero zero here five minus seven can we subtract seven from five no then what we have to do in this case we have to borrow one from the next place right so if you borrow one from it will become fifteen and this will become five so fifteen minus seven fifteen minus seven is how much eight right good and here five minus four is one so let's put the comma. Where after hundred, right? So you need ten hundred thousand ten thousand. So what is your answer? That is eighteen thousand. So it is your estimated difference. Okay. So now let's take the second example. So here it is the second one. That is forty five thousand six hundred thirty minus thirty two thousand one hundred forty eight. Okay. So here it is the. So same example I have written here. You can see. So first what you have to do? You have to Round off these both numbers to nearest thousand place, right? So here zero minus sorry zero, you need zero zero and here zero. So here six is there. So what we have to do? We have to add plus one to the number where at the thousand place, right? So it will become what six and this one it will you have to keep it as it is. So it become what forty six thousand, right? 
yes so minus here yeah, come to the 32148 so if you see the number at 100 place it is 1 means what is yes, what you have to do you have to keep the numbers unchanged which numbers so these both numbers that is 1000 and 10000 so you need 100 sorry 100 uh, sorry 10 100 so here it is 32 as it is so now let's do the subtraction so 46000 minus 32000 okay so 0 minus 0 0 0 minus 0 0 0 minus 0 0 6 minus 2 is how much it is 4 4 minus 3 is 1 so what is your answer that is 14000 so this is the estimated difference got it yes so now let's take the third one so here it is the third one 57146 minus 25472 okay so see here what you have to do you have to round off the number i mean both the numbers you have to round off to the nearest thousand place so in the hundred place we are having one means yes what will the answer here what will the rounded form of this number to the nearest thousand place it is for 57,000. Very good. You have to keep it as it is. So, 57,000. Okay, minus. Here, 25,472. Here, 4 is there. Means, what is the rounded form of this number to the nearest 1,000 place? It is 25,000. Right? Yes. Very good, children. Now, let's subtract it. For 57,000 minus 25 so let's see your answer 0 minus 0 0 0 minus 0 0 0 minus 0 0 comma 5 minus 7 minus 5 7 minus 5 is how much it is 2 5 minus 2 is it is 3 so what is our estimated difference it is 32,000 is our estimated difference okay now let's take the fourth and the last one so here it is there 60,046 minus 15,247. Okay. So, here I am having the same example. So, let's solve it. So, what we will do here as we always do in our all the videos while solving the last example that just pause the video, try to solve it by yourself. Later, you continue it and check your answer with my answer. Okay. Hope you will do it correctly. I know that you will do it. Okay. So, let's do it. So, I hope you all have solved it. So, here is your answer. That is 45,000 is your estimated difference. Okay. Yes. So, yes children. In today's class, we have solved the fifth main. In the next class, we will continue with the six main so till then take care of yourself be with me and if you have not seen the previous videos you can get the, the link in my description box just go and check it out and uh, if you think this video is really useful to you then don't forget to like share with your friends and do subscribe my channel so till then bye bye